All right, Wednesday quickie. It's a review of some, something I bought in my haul of crap stuff. And this is uh, Zataran's Bacon Crisp for Pork Chops. So let's give it a try, shall we? I've got some thick, thin cut pork chops here. I trimmed off of as much fat as I could. And there's that stuff. And it says to use an egg, I got two eggs. So, oh, first thing I gotta do is put some of this Tsang stir fry oil on the bottom of my pan, the paddle's out. So let me put some of that there. Okay, so you take the pork chop, then you go in the egg first. It stuff smells good, I'll tell you that. And then into the crap. So far, anything Zatarans is good. So, I think I'm gonna like this one. All right, so coat your pork chop, and I'm just gonna lay that in there. We'll finish this, and then we'll get back to the air fryer. All right, so we got pork chops in there. I'm gonna turn the bottom on, the top one at four, and I'm not gonna put any uh, olive oil on top yet. I usually spray the top, but I'm gonna cook it for about five minutes first. So let's go. We'll do that. All right. It's been about, let's say, 15 minutes or so. I'm going to check the temperature of the thickest cut in here. And we're passing 170. So she's done. Let's turn it off. I'll play it and we'll taste it. We'll be back. All right. Time to taste. It's nice and crispy. It smells delicious. All right, so here it goes. Mmm. That's good. I taste some garlic in there. I don't know. It's not spicy. It's flavorful. It's not salty or anything. It's pretty good for a pork chop. Pork chop's tender, by the way. Air fryer does not make meat tough. I'm telling you that right now. But yeah, I'm digging it. It's pretty good. Well, you're going to get, well, I'm going to say, I might say a 4.5 out of 5. It was good. I mean, I thought it was going to be a little bit spicy because it's Zatarans, but... It's full of flavor. A little tiny little kick in the back. But anyways, I recommend it. Alright guys, thanks for shopping. Bye.